Hi there, it's Tanya again from Tutter Treasures. So I'm back again <coughs> with my plain bases. I think there's probably going to be too many here to do um, in one video. So I've got a few embellishments already made. These are in the Botanical series. These are some, I think I called them faux stamps and faux uh, frames. So I thought they're like ready-made embellishments which I can just put on a tag and that one was from um, like a product review. I was uh, using the stamps. So I've just got those out. So <coughs> I think first I'm going to pick, these are all quite like dumpy so I don't know if these are actually going to... Um, sit right on them yeah they are very dumpy so that's probably one of the taller ones so that's taller but it's quite thin if I straightened that up a bit and then just cut that I could probably do that um, let's have a look at these so they're quite yeah I think I'm gonna have to do something else with those dumpy ones so I could probably put that on there so let's get a small one I wonder if I can do that on there and then that one on there yeah that will probably go I'm not sure about that one it's not taller than that no it's about the same hmm might be able to do something with that that's better on there and on there no I like that one on there so I'm going to build it up so I'll try I can't make my mind up I think this one so I think I'll do these today and then I'll come back another time and do these ones so I'm going to clip these ones back together and put them in my um, needed to-do pile and we'll just get these ones done so sorry about the dog it's like this I'm gonna pause for a second okay I think his is that his barking session so I'm gonna start off by just inking all around I could have done that while I was pausing it wasn't that long actually, he went down, stood barking at the window and then that was it. So I shall ink around these and then I think I'll just do some collage um, around, around the back of them. Um, I do need to fill my collage folder up. I have been trying to get everything used and then print out, you know, some new stuff. Um, <clears throat> but I just want to get, get it all used first because you can just keep printing stuff and, and never actually use everything. So I'm thinking if I use everything and then I can start, you know, can print so much graph paper out so much newsprint and text and you know all that kind of stuff right so let's have a look what I've got so I've got some of this rusty paper I do think that would be nice um <coughs> around the back of there I don't know why I've put the ink away but I'm gonna have to I'll do it like the same size as the, the tag so yeah 
still gives us a bit of a, a bit of a border. Oh, my belly's rumbling. It is tea time. But um, I filmed a couple of these videos today and I just wanted to to get finished um, the things that, that I got out. But yeah, <laughs> I had planned on doing all those tags, what you've just seen, but I've, I've had enough really for today. So that's going to go there. That's going to go there. I think we want something else. Probably going to go for the brown tissue. Just gives it a bit of a bit of interest. So just see what that looks like. that's fine so I'm gonna lay this down first I'm gonna go that way um, I'm gonna need the fabric type for that so see if I can get everything else glued down with the kalal I said right at the beginning of the day I'm gonna use kalal for for the day but halfway through I did end up with um, the art glitter glue and then I never never put it back down again so pop that there he's whining because Ryan snipped out and he doesn't like it when his dad goes out especially he kind of knows when he's going to work and he's not as whiny then uh, he must know that you know he's got to go to work um, but yeah, if he if he's been to work and then he goes back out, oh, he hates it. So I might have to wait a little while till this comes comes down. There's not too much left in it. So I'm hoping to get these videos up um, like two a week, um, and I'm going to try and mix mix the videos up because I've been filming some pockets and tags I'm just going to do it to the side um so yeah I'm hoping like to just mix it up a bit so you might not get it in the actual order that I film but I've not really spoke about anything in particular um so I don't think it'll be confusing but um yeah I'm trying to empty that pot because um I want it for for things that are actually finished um, and ready to to use so that's that obviously I need to put a topper in yeah it's very um, plain but um, yeah I'm not minding that I don't know if I don't think I want to, to stick anything else on um, it's good to have a few plain things so let's have a look at this because obviously that's going to want cutting down a little bit. So I don't think I'm going to put actually anything else on there. I'm going to just stick stick that down. So I have got some of these left. I think in the in the Etsy shop. I did make quite a few of them up. So I was just using all the small, small things out of kits up. Because, um, yeah, I've got loads. And I always think that I do use most of the kits. You know, when, when I use them, I do try and use everything. But, yeah, there's certain, like, little bits you just don't get around to, to using. So I'd ended up with... With like a tub full of them and I thought oh it's a good way uh, to get rid of them so and it's obviously made made me an easy easy tags so let's have a look at this one oh, I really like that it's a shame that we're gonna cut most of the um the nice dark music out so I don't want to have it too far up because I've got to think um there so yeah i do tend to want to go middle 
I think I'm gonna smell this. This is a lovely colour. So if I rip it, it's on there. I bet you I've got a bin full of ripped things from today. Could really get it all and glue it down and I'd have <laughs> twenty collage sheets. So yeah, I like that there. Oh yeah. These are very uh, dark, aren't they? But the ones that I've just done was very green. So, um, yeah, you have to think about what else is in, in your stash. And like I've said in the other videos, you don't want everything totally over, over decorated. Because when you come to use them, everything's going to be too bulky so you're not going to be able to use many of your pieces plus say if i was doing a file folder and i've got something loud there and something loud there it all clashes um and it, it's too much for the eyeball to take in i think so again i'll leave that one like that right let's see if we can use this bit of paper on oh i can't wait to um print some some new stuff off but, um, I must be strong and make sure I do um, you know get get to the end of, of what I've got because I think we do that we start off and we say right we're going to get rid of everything and then we either buy some more stuff or um, you know where it is so I think I'm going to put that there You know, we say this, don't we? I'm not going to print anything else off or I'm not going to start any more projects till this is done. And and then, you know, you start off and you, you're dead good. And then after a bit, you're just like, oh, I need to either, you know, I want something new. Either buy something, print something, you know, whatever the new is. I think I'm going to have that bit, a bit lowered down. Like so. Love this tissue. It's um, very much like the, the tea bags. Um, it's just like a natural. And I do think that I just picked it up from, I don't know, either the post office or it was somewhere local. Um, and it was one of them, shall I, shan't I, do I want it, don't I? Um, and I'm so glad that I did because... It's very much like um, the tea bag paper, um, and I tend to go through tea bags like no tomorrow. So that's that. I'm gonna just move that to the side a bit. That's it. Here we go again. I'm so I think he's just on high alert because Ryan's not here. Right, I'm going to go down the side with this one. I'm going to pause. Right, hopefully, is uh, is I don't know. It's still downstairs, so I could start again. Um, so I've just stuck that rusty piece down, and I've just got a bit of the uh, tissue. Just seeing what um, a bit of green looks like. And this is a wallpaper from uh, Lorna at Tailor Made Journals. Um, it's either set one or set two of her grungy, I don't know if it's grungy vintage or, or not. I'm not sure about the green actually. I think I'm going to just keep all these quite neutral. So I'm going to rip a bit more of this off. I'm going to get rid of that bit because I did spill some tea or coffee. I think it was coffee. Right. Let's um, have a look at this. Yeah, that's better. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I did that with my nail. I haven't even got any nails. And I'm surprised because I normally, I've never had very fast growing nails, but um, 
Yeah, normally when I'm at work, they do snap off and I've, I've not been to work for a couple of months. So I'm surprised um, that they're so short. But yeah, they seem to grow to a certain length and then they just snap. But they've never been, you know, some people grow the nails and they're attractive, like they're nice nails, but... I can't say mine's ever been nice and I've never had them them done. Um, my mum has hers done. She has a toenails done as well. How bizarre. Anyway, shouldn't be talking about one's mother. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's only something she's done in the last few years and yeah, she really likes it. So I don't think when she was younger, uh, well, I know damn well, she wouldn't have had the, t the patience or the time uh, to sit and, and have them done so I think now it's a bit of a it's a bit of a luxury but obviously I'm the same I just think oh what a waste of time and and stuff just sitting there so that's that one I'm quite happy with them I'm gonna say I do think when you just look at them it yeah they're they're a bit bland but um yeah I'm thinking overall um and I definitely needed just some neutral um, looking things. So I'm just going to get all my lids on. Um, and we'll... Oh, I'm going to have to wipe my hands. I could have perhaps done a couple more of them tags. Because it's only going to be a short video. But yeah, I think I've got to my limit. I need to go and do some food. So Ryan's nipped out and I think he's nipping to McDonald's on the way home for for him, himself. But I need to do me oh I will need those. I need to do me and Ellen or something. Right, so yeah, I've definitely not got a lot of collage stuff left. It is going to be very, uh, you know, same, same until it's all gone. <laughs> You'll be all like, oh, we're sick of seeing a little collage bag. Right. That's all that away. I'm just deciding if I want to use, um, I feel like I need to use these strings up because they've absolutely drove me mad. Um, they just all keep going on each other's bit. It's like, oh, just stay where you're supposed to stay. But um, they won't. So, <laughs> yeah, I'll be glad when I've used them. So I think I'm going to go for this darker brown. Um, yeah, I wish I had the time and patience to undo it all. Um it could be a job for Alan, I can <laughs> Oh, she'd love that. She'd think I was just making things up for her to do. Right, I think I'm going to use... <coughs> um, I'm not going to put metal ones in them. I'm going to use the, the paper ones. Because <coughs> I think they'll <coughs> blend in really nice. So... <coughs> Glue off me and I've got hair stuck to me. So go middle ish. Try for the middle. <laughs> These music ones are um, a digital from Juni at uh, Willow Band Journals. I think I did actually win a free kit on one of her giveaways and yeah I chose this one because um I do I do like some neutral um kits. Like I say then you've got your background already there. And um there's a certain music book I I have um which I really like but um sometimes it's out of stock on Amazon. Um, and then when you look around for other ones, they can be quite expensive. So it's a good one for when you can't get your hands on some music paper. 
Like, hair there. I don't. That's it. I think I've got it stuck to my um my finger. I'm gonna put one on the back as as well. Apart from I've now got glue on my fingers, and when I put my finger in that envelope, everything's stuck to me. So that's that. Um, I'll do some round ones. I do rarely like the hexagon ones. Uh, violet does me, does me my uh, die cuts. And say so, about it drives that absolutely bonkers. But I've seen that you can buy um, little punches that do these. So I don't know if to... I think uh, Fiona's got one actually. Um, Miss Paint a lot. Um, so I don't know if they're any good. Because that would be a good one to have. Because I, I do think um, I'm going to buy myself um, a tab punch as well. Because... Um, yeah, I bet it really gets on, on Violet's nerves, like doing the small things. Because you're going to have to keep putting it through the die cut, aren't you? Oh. So I think if I get myself um, something to do the reinforcers. I mean, I have got some of the stickers and I do sometimes use them. But um, they're all white and I do like to ink over them and get some script stamp over them to give them some some interest so I do need to to get another strip out and and do them but I, do, I really do like them in the craft but I think you can buy those sticky ones in the craft paper actually so yeah I might have a look for those because if I could get a load of those cheap it might be cheaper to to just get some stickers then it would obviously save you save your glue in. So anything with glue in is really you do have to wait a minute for it to glue you down otherwise once you're putting your material in or your string in um, you can pull pull your thing out. Right let's put this back on. So while I'm waiting for it to dry <laughs> I'm just going to run this try. And this is what happens here. I just add to the chaos. <laughs> oh, I might actually need some more. I've not cut that much off. But I'm not bow like putting a bow in, in these ones. Right. So, I think... Yeah, I did look on Etsy at people selling um, tabs and stuff. And there's not many people who do it. And the people who I did see do it, there was like packs of bright colours and stuff. And it's like, I just want craft colour or green. Um, I don't want... I'll tie that. Um, I don't want, you know, all different colours. that at the top I'm going to knot it again oh I think my eyes have had enough for today okay, that's that I might just have enough string so this is hemp string and say so it feels really nice it's it's a really nice soft string. I do think that that's probably why it keeps moulding together with itself. Because um, it's soft. Maybe if it was harsh it wouldn't, wouldn't do that. I don't know. It's just my theory. Right, two more. And then that is it. So... I'm so pleased to be getting done my pile. I will get that tub emptied so I can get all made things in there. I 
think when I'm doing the challenges from now on, I think I'm going to say, like, the challenge is over now and I'm going to decorate them. If you want to stay, um, you know, carry on watching. If not, then, then you know, don't um, and get them done because they do soon um, build up. So that's it. Five little tags. Um, I really like them. I don't know if anyone else will, but I do. Um, yeah, just just what I needed. So thank you very much for joining me today. Um, like I say, I'm really happy with with how much I've I've got done. Um, and this is my tub now. It's getting absolutely chocker which is fabulous so you can see i've got that's why i wanted to do brown because when i looked across the top i thought mm, there's a lot of green so um yeah i thought it was time for for some brown stuff um and this is my pot of things still to do so yeah there's there's not too many at all now um i think another you know few sessions and that could be empty then i can start splitting it up and having journal cards and tags in one and then envelopes and pockets in the other um and then it'll be easier just to pull pull out what what i need so thank you so much for keeping me company i really do appreciate it um yeah if you want to comment say hello or anything in the comments then please do because i do like to to hear from you um if most things are in my description there's ways how to support me and my uh channel there should be links to kits and things that i've used um and if you do want to you know oh where did you get blah blah from then do ask um, you know i i do try and give people links and that when when they ask so i'm going and i shall see you very soon bye for now